Mina-san konnichiwa. This is David. And Mina. And this evening we wanted to do a quick um, little loot haul video because somebody asked us um, to do a video detailing the random Gundam crap we get. <laughs> um, so we are going to acquiesce to that request. Uh, we had a pretty good weekend anyway for this, these sort of things. Um, so <laughs> first set of random things. Glasses. Uh, we have 35th anniversary Gundam glasses. Um, yeah, there's the first one with the RX-78-2, and then we have the RX-78-2's face. <laughs> and then lastly, this one's actually not an anniversary one, this one's from Unicorn. This is um, a map of the sides um, in celebration of Unicorn. So, got a few of these. Um, we'll probably be using those in our drinking videos uh, in the future. They're beautiful. They are really lovely. They're a nice solid glass, and we paid a dollar a piece for them. So. Yeah, exactly. Um, Mina picked up these on um, the series of notebooks here. Yeah, these are just blank books, but when you open them up, they give suggestions of, you know, yeah, in this, this case, nice. Shara's quotes. Yeah, it's it's quotes from Shar Aznable. And then they all have stickers. Mm. Um, we've got to do something with these. Yeah, we really do. We really um, do. And then we've got this beautiful Principality of Xeon one. Um, it's a sticker. More stickers. And then it has, what are those? Oh, it looks like plans. Yeah, secret plans. Yes. Yeah, the Solar and Ray actually, Project. I think right, the pages are really lovely too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. If, uh, if you're unfamiliar, basically, um, Japan loves its stationery. And I love its stationery. <laughs> so that's... And then we have our operation. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's lovely. Mm -hmm. The pages. Oh, yeah, this it's got the, the blueprints for the yeah. RX-78, too. Mm -hmm. That's great. And then lastly, we have <laughs> so funny. the Haro user manual. The so cute. And Haro. And it comes with Haro stickers. And then instructions, do not kick the Haro. <laughs> do not kick the Haro. Yes, do not remodel the Haro. <laughs> uh, outer space okay. Do not fall on Haro. Outer space okay. <laughs> and then we have our children from the white base very hanging out cute. with the Haro. Yeah. Very, very cute. So it's adorable stuff. It's like stuff. a date book, really. I, I believe, mean. yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. It's a date book. <clears throat> Okay, so we have notebooks. Yeah, I've been sort of collecting the weirdest possible Gundam tie-in uh, paperwork, you know, that sort of thing. I found a pencil case, not a pencil case, a pencil lead. Mm. And it's just a little plastic container of pencil lead with a little Gundam head on the side of it, and that's Gundam tie-in. <laughs> so next we have, this is the Strike Freedom in 7-Eleven colors. Mm. Um, if you're not familiar, uh, occasionally 7-Eleven does these. Pretty pretty frequently they do these. Um, and this is an older one. And basically it is the Strike Freedom in green and white and red um, for 7-Eleven. Um, and it is the version GFT, which is the version Gundam Front Tokyo. So it's identical to the one that you would get in the gift shop, um, except it's in 7-Eleven colors. Right. Yeah. And we built, what, a bear guy? Yes, we also we, we do have the bear guy. Um, yeah. We did not build the RX-78-2 that we got. Oh, okay. But we do have it. Mm. We'll build it soon. Um, so we got that. A product placement shelf. Yeah, it was like 800 yen, so, you know, why not? <laughs> um, we picked up the Wing Zero Hono. I know some of you are waiting for it. Here it is. Yes, we, I'm going to be doing an unboxing later, and I'm also going to be building it and doing a review. Very soon. And then lastly, we found the Berry Berry Bear Guy family. <laughs> Yes. Um, I was actually really concerned about this one uh, because when I went looking for it, it vanished. Couldn't find it. Yep. But we found this one, so I'm going to do a quick unboxing. Um, this is occasionally Bandai does these exclusives where you get a song from the show and mm -hmm. it's single. Um, so this is one of the songs from Bill Fighters Try. And the cute young men who sing it. Like, yeah, I believe, I think it's the opening song, but I'm not sure. Yeah, maybe. I think so. Oh. I don't know. Um, so there's that. And then we have the Bear Guy. This is the Bear Guy F, just like the one from Build Fighters Try. Except it's all in pink. Um, so yeah, it's it's, it's pretty awesome. Mm -hmm. And it's going to be wonderful. Yeah. Um, and then we're going to have like the matching pink and red um, baby bear guy to go with it. 
Uh, I don't know if you guys saw, but there's actually going to be four of the little tiny bear guys, like that guy. Yeah, there's going to be four different ones, and they're going to match the ones that are in the ending credits for Bill Fighters Try. Yes. Um, so we're going to be picking those up, too. We're yes. big Bear Guy fans. Big so. Bear Guy fans. Anyway, that's our weekend haul. Um, someone asked us to do it, so we're doing it. There we go. This is this is our um, showing you that we listen. Um, <laughs> so. And we spend tens of dollars on this stuff. So, yes, you know. yes. So um, <laughs> if you like our stuff, please like, subscribe, comment. Clearly the comments do have some influence. Yep. Uh, we pay attention. Yes, there's the bear guy. Uh, <laughs> and matane, everyone. Matane.